So you guys get to watch me put this antenna together. I haven't said too much, I'll narrate it later on. Or I'll add some narration to everything. Not quite sure how this all goes, but there's no really no directions for this, so I'm just kind of winging it. But it's a video. This is a MFJ 1868 scanner antenna that apparently works pretty well as a transmitter. So that's what I'm doing. I have two cameras going, that's why I'm kind of doing things a little weird. I have the top piece done, just about. I'm not going to put the center feed on it. I'll have to get a wrench to tighten these down, but this is how you put it together. And then, pick up these rods. And now I have to screw these bottom pieces in. It's starting to look like a giant porcupine. According to the guy that I talked to, oh shoot, these are bent a little bit, but I don't think that matters. I don't blame my wife. We went to the antique store yesterday. She bought some stuff. Oh wow. It really did get bent. That's a bummer. Well, it's not the end of the world. So as you can see, I'm screwing everything in because 
I'm a man and we don't read directions. At least not on purpose. Now supposedly, when I finish this antenna, the SWR on it is supposed to be pretty close to perfect. My only problem is I have no idea how to hook up the uh, cable to this thing. It comes with 50 feet of cable. Hey cat. Psst. One of my cats has decided that she likes what she sees. Oh, I can't do that. I guess I'll have to go upright with this. So, I know you can't see my face. Well, you can see some of my face, but whatever, you'll have to deal with that. Hmm. Kitty. Watch is stuck. And I think what I do after I'm done is I just pretend like pretend like um, I know what I'm doing, even though I don't. So I have a bunch of other things I have to deal with. I have this bag. You can hear my cat, and she's doing weird stuff. Okay. And there you have it. I've put it all together. You can't see the whole thing. And I have my camera set to the widest angle. Um, but... Jeez, I wonder if there's something missing. No place to screw the coax into. You know what? I bet there is. Son of a gun. Well, that's kind of a drag. Well, anyway. And then you just put think you can see the top piece anyway and you just slide that in and that's a done antenna so I know the one camera's running but the good one even though the top is not quite that's done all right I'm gonna stop the camera and we'll try it again in a bit Okay, everybody, this is the antenna. I've got it, as you can see, put pretty well together. I'm just putting the radial arms on now. I've already tightened this piece up. Uh, that gave me a little difficulty. I had to adjust it because this piece down here, if you put it too low, it, 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 it gets in the way of the radial. So you had to move it down. It's just an aluminum pipe. And I'm going to use tie wraps because that's the right thing to do. But I'm going to use a package of tie wraps to put it around this pole. And that's going to secure it for a while. If not, just maybe temporarily for a bit. Until we get into a little more permanent structure. So here you go. Here's another part of the whole game. Also, when you put these radials on, use, um, sorry, I'm looking through my viewfinder, but, oh, there we go. When you put these on, do them one at a time and give yourself some space, because if you try to tighten them down afterwards, it's kind of a nightmare. As you can see, I just put a little divot in the aluminum. It's no big deal, it's just a pole, but just give yourself some room some room to do it as you're putting them all in and then when I get the whole antenna put together I'll give you another look I'm not quite sure I think it's a 10-foot pole but I'm not 100% sure but it's up in the air 
It's a wire for my dipole running by. And I have a little drip loop in it, which I think you're supposed to do, but I'm not sure. I have it uh, coax taped up. It's probably a bad angle, but you can see it. Zip tied to the fence post because that's the best way to do things. And now I just have my cords all over my trailer and I'm going to plug that in shortly. So stay tuned. Alrighty boys and girls, this is the finished product. She's up. Now that dipole you see in the background, I'm going to go fix that. But in the meantime, she's up. Hope you enjoyed this. Although I might not be done yet.